aboard, everybody. My name is Chuck. I'll be your pilot. We're going to be trying out some advanced features on this chopper, so get ready for a wild ride. And stand by for takeoff. I'm going to raise you up to the observation deck. Everyone, I'm going to prepare for takeoff. Hold on to your hats. Here we go! Today we're talking about energy. You know, electricity and natural gas. Electricity comes through wires and natural gas comes into our homes through underground pipes as fuel to heat our homes, heat our water, and cook our food. Some natural gas that we use today took millions of years to form. Let's take a look. Hang on, I'm going to try out our new time warp travel option. Whoa, cool, cool, we went way back in time. Anyways, millions of years ago, bacteria and organic matter like trees and plants and animals that died were slowly pushed underground. And over time, oh. under great pressure, turned into oil, coal, and natural gas. Oh, no. Pterodactyls! Let's see if we can get back to our own time. Whew, that was a close one. So, back to energy. As well as natural gas, we also use a lot of electricity. We use it for pretty much everything, from the lights in our homes and shops and schools to charging all our devices like phones and tablets. For a long time, we burned coal and oil to generate that electricity, but it was very dirty and really bad for our environment. Recently, we've come up with some new ways to create renewable sources of energy. These turbines, for example, create electricity using just the wind. Uh, just don't get too close to their spinning blades. Hang on! Okay, I meant to do that. Hey, look, solar panels. These guys capture energy from the sun and turn it into electricity, too. But what happens when the wind isn't blowing, when the sun isn't shining? We use natural gas in huge power plants like this one to generate electricity. Roughly half of our electricity in this area comes from natural gas. Most natural gas comes out of the ground. See, we have to drill down really deep to get it out, and that's what we call a non-renewable resource. Once it's used up, it's gone. But guess what? Natural gas can also be renewable. Check this out. This truck is picking up yard waste, like leaves and grass, that came out of somebody's garden. Let's zoom ahead and see where it goes. This is a waste recovery facility, and our truck has dumped all of that yard waste and other stuff right here. Then it all goes over there. Those domes are called anaerobic digesters. You want to take a look inside? Okay. Oh, kind of dark. Let's add some light. All that gunk decomposes in here, and that process gives off a gas. Methane gas, or renewable natural gas. It can go into the pipes and right into our houses or even to power plants to generate electricity. It can also power cars and trucks. Here's our waste truck again, getting refueled from the clean, renewable natural gas being produced right here in the anaerobic digester. You know what these are, right? Correct. They're cows. And what do cows produce a lot of? Poop. That's right. I said poop. That poop can actually be made into renewable natural gas, too. What? They collect all that cow manure and take it to another anaerobic digester where it goes through the same kind of process and becomes renewable natural gas. Time to head home, everybody. But on the way, I've got one more cool thing I can tell you about. Let's go! Oops. Nope. Sorry, coming through. Sorry about that. The uh, travel monster is a bit buggy sometimes. Anyways, take a look at this. Scientists are now working on ways to make natural gas from electricity. It's called power to gas. And remember those renewable sources, like wind and solar farms? See, they sometimes make too much electricity. So instead of wasting it, we can take it and convert it to hydrogen. It can be stored in pipes underground to use later. It can even be used to fuel hydrogen-powered cars and trucks. As we continue to transition to more renewable sources of energy, we keep making our world a more comfortable and cleaner place to live. Heli-1, you are cleared for return to Discovery Q. Copy that. Heli-1, out. 